so hi guys this is my nighttime routine so basically all the products that i use um in my nighttime routine i'm going to be sharing this with you guys in this video now, i do want to say that i have three different routines that i alternate during the week if that makes sense i have my tretinoin slash retinol routine so basically my retinoid routine so sometimes i use my tretinoin and sometimes i just use my retinol and the next night i like to do my skin brightening routine i've been doing it for a while now where i just focus on using brightening products on my face for that night one thing that i struggle with is dark spots and hyperpigmentation i'm going to leave pictures so you guys can see where my skin has come from i used to have like hyperpigmentation around my mouth i used to have dark spots you can still see a little bit of dark spot left but this routine has really 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 helped me and then finally i have my exfoliation routine these are basically the routine that help me keep my skin in check ensures that my skin stays clear smooth and nice granted my skin is not perfect my skin is probably not where i want it to be but my skin has come a long way you see me repeat some products in the course of the routine there are some products that i use over and over again um, and then there's some products that I like to change up. It depends on what I'm using for that night. You might just see me change one or two products. I like to keep my overall skincare routine very simple, very budget friendly. And let's get right into it. So I like to start my week off with my tretinoin routine. So to start off, I'm going to cleanse my skin. Typically, I double cleanse, but because I've not been outside, I've been indoors all day and I did not wear any makeup or any sunscreen. So I'm just going to cleanse using my mouth cleanser. It is really important to cleanse your skin, especially if you're going to be using a potent ingredient like tretinoin to cleanse your skin using a mouth cleanser. So this cleanser is really mild it is from the simple brand and i really love it so after cleansing for 60 seconds i rinse off my face and then on to the other products so first off i'll go in with a toner and i love to use a mild soothing toner nothing with any active ingredient in it and currently i'm loving the annual heart sleeve 77 percent soothing toner this is really good doesn't irritate your skin it actually like soothes and calms the skin so i just like to use my palms to tap it into my skin now the method i love to use for my tretinoin routine is the sandwich method so this basically means going in first with a moisturizer of any kind um then your tretinoin and then you finish off with a moisturizer now, the moisturizer is supposed to act as a buffer so the tretinoin is not going directly on your skin right so that way you're reducing any irritation that might come up so instead of going in with my moisturizer i'm going to go in with this essence this is a very hydrating product so this is going to act as my first layer of um, moisturizer right so you can basically just use moisturizer for this step applying this i would typically just let this sit for a while on my face so you just want to give your skin a little bit of time to properly absorb this before going in with the tretinoin this is a tretinoin that i use i don't know the brand i just get it from my um skincare vendor i use the 0.05 percent so this is the mid strength and this is fine for me this is the um, tretinoin cream you can use tretinoin gel whichever it is sometimes i get tretinoin gel sometimes i get um, the cream you want to use only a pea size amount so picture what a pea looks like and that is how much you, you should be using this much for my entire face so i like to dot on my forehead my cheeks a little on the bridge of my nose just fully apply this i don't know if you notice but i am avoiding my eye area after applying the tretinoin i like to let it sit for three to five minutes again just to give my skin time to properly absorb this before finishing off with a moisturizer so you can use whichever moisturizer you have just ensure that the moisturizer is uh, mild it doesn't contain any irritating ingredients like acids you know those kinds of ingredients this is a simple moisturizer you guys saw that i um, avoided my eye area while applying the tretinoin so 
on that area i love to use my eye cream i'm currently loving the mary and may eye cream so i'm going to put on my silk bonnet and i'll go to bed and i'll see you guys on my next night and so the next night i love to do my skin brightening routine so this is basically where i use a bunch of brightening products in order to you know treat hyperpigmentation dark spots so this night i started off by double cleansing because i have a little bit of makeup on and i've been out and about so of course i have layers and layers of sunscreen on my face so i start off by using an oil cleanser I used the annual soothing oil cleanser and then I go in with my cleanser. This is the one that I'm currently loving. It is from Replenix and it contains salicylic acid, which is amazing for, you know, also brightening the skin and treating um, acne. So I just work that into my skin. Of course, employing the 60 seconds rule, I work it into my skin and then I rinse it off and there's just the smoothness this amazing smoothness that you get on your skin when you double cleanse so after that i'm going to go in with the same toner that i used the night before which is from the annual brand and i'm just going to pat that into my skin you can also use any toner it is you have available this is just the one i chose to use this night so i let that dry down and then i'm going to go in with my um serum i love this serum like the hype on the serum i see it now so this is the annual niacinamide and tranexamic acid serum and as we know those two ingredients are amazing for brightening the skin so i'm just going to apply that all over my face i love the serum and i swear to god i'm not just saying it this serum has worked really really well for my skin like look at that glow can you see the glow it leaves like i love the serum after that i'm going to go in with another brightening serum like i said this is my brightening routine so i love to use a bunch of brightening products now this is the good molecules um discoloration serum i really really love this one as well it's amazing for hyperpigmentation these serums together is like my holy grail now for the star of the show as a lake acid this is amazing for those dark stubborn spots if you have areas of your face where you have like stubborn dark spots or hyperpigmentation you need this so i basically just focus this on it, those areas of my face where i have like hyperpigmentation like around my mouth my cheeks as a lake acid has really worked wonders for my hyperpigmentation and dark spots then i go in with my eye cream now this is completely optional except if you have dark circles like me if you have panda eyes then get you a brightening under eye cream then i'm going to finish off with my face cream i'm using the same face cream that i used the night before like i said i use some products um every single night right you don't need a different face cream for a different night we're trying to save some coins now on to night three now this is my exfoliation night i focus on exfoliating my skin it is really important that you exfoliate your skin and now the best way to exfoliate your face is by using a chemical exfoliant so i start off by cleansing my skin i love to use a mouth cleanser nothing drying or stripping and then i go in with my chemical exfoliant i love the ordinary aj stroke bha peeling solution and no this doesn't peel your skin it just gently exfoliates your skin so i'm just going to apply it all over my face ensure to avoid your eye area and sensitive areas of your face just apply it all over leave it on for 10 minutes and then i rinse off i do want to mention that i do not use this every single day of the week i only use it twice in a week so i after it has dried down, this is what it should look like. I go ahead and rinse this off. And you can immediately see the difference this makes on my face. Like my face is smooth, it is soft, and it has this amazing glow to it. Now, after that, I'm going to go in with my toner. You can basically use any toner it is you have. Um, and then I'm going to go in with a serum i love to use the annual serum like this has become my favorite serum to use like this serum works wonder on my skin guys get it it is not just hyped for nothing so after that i go in with my eye cream and then i finish off with 
a moisturizer i'm currently loving this cosara x um all-in-one cream i believe that's what it's called um i recently got it and i'm just trying it for the first time and i am amazed by how well this applies on the skin like Ugh, it applies so well and it leaves your skin feeling really plump i'm going to do a full review on this after i've used it for a while so that's basically it for my routine i repeat this routine again um throughout the week and i end up um you know doing each routine like twice in a week okay <laughs> So this is my updated nighttime routine um i hope you guys found it helpful let me know if you have any questions leave them in the comment section um give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful do not forget to subscribe to my channel click on the bell icon to get notified whenever i post a new video and thank you guys so much for watching i'll talk to you guys in my next one